Story tonight, a number of tenants at the Barrington Suites in Temple have received eviction notices telling them to vacate their homes due to not paying rent. The problem is the tenants say they were told by management to withhold rent until they were done with renovations after May's tornado. Six News anchor Adriana Alexander is here to clear up some confusion and explain renter rights. Adriana. Bailey, after our story aired last Monday, Barrington Suites management sent a letter to their tenants informing them that withholding rent was a rumor and everyone still needs to pay their rent. I spoke with legal expert Liz Mitchell and she explained that the only way tenants could withhold rent is if they have that information in writing. Even then, tenants will have to reread their leasing agreement and see if that stipulation is written in there too. If you withhold rent because of rumors or if you have issues in your apartment, Mitchell says you're making yourself vulnerable to being evicted. When there are weather events, if your apartment individually has not been damaged to the extent that it is uninhabitable, you must continue to pay your rent. If you feel it's uninhabitable, there are steps under the law in which you have to take before you stop paying your rent. Now in that letter that was sent to tenants, management also added that they do not anticipate everyone will have to move out for repairs to be done. Tonight at 10, Mitchell will explain a better way to maneuver as a renter who's dealing with issues at their apartment. Bailey. Good follow up, Adriana. Thanks for staying on top of this for us. Well